There's the lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. I hope. Please let me make it there. Come on, Max. You can make it. So surreal. Famously called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. <laughs> there you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can yeah, hear the class laughing at me now. Eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as torture. I should take right? it plus it's perfect for my And I have to get my daily selfie quota. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height? I can't believe I still have this pencil dresses. case. I should upgrade she to the 21st century. But I like it she old school. Taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. He captured the essence of post-war beat America. I do love my analog camera. About the I should take a quick America, picture now. But a beauty in the struggle. You, you don't have beauty without a beat. Which explains why Frank was Kerouac's photographic muse. And both were the great chroniclers of the 1950s. Well, we've all seen... Shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean... And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she? F I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. I just really think Everyday Heroes is an important cultural event, and I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by participating, by putting yourself out there in the world. 
No, no matter who wins. This is just a Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. Bump on a bigger road. I don't want to I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have to you always Welcome to the real world. Just cute. Hot. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture of Jeremy. What's the point of everything? Because Max wants everybody to see how cute she is. But she plays it so sharp. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that guys. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day.
It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Yes, he likely was. These pieces of time can frame us in I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. can you give me an example of Damn, a photographer I cannot believe who this. captured the human condition in black and white? Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her image. I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly captured human the human time condition machine. black and white. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't Hi, freak out. Arbus. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her Keep it together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. When I took my selfie, Jefferson so asked me a question. Tortured, right? If he does again, if anybody else looked at this, what would they think?
Thank you.